What's going on, Explorers? Brandon Abandon, the Six Four Explorer, Explorer and Thoroughback Stickland. I got a really cool spot for you guys today. I'm at a farmhouse with a barn, but the barn was used as a secondhand store and a old antique barn. Like, it's beautiful. It's just full of stuff. You guys are gonna love it. The house has me a little bit confused, though. There's a whole bunch of, like, big cages in it. They pretty much use a full room as a cage. They've got, like, big sticks. I don't know if they had monkeys and you could come and shop at the barn and then pay five bucks and go see the monkeys or if they just had snakes or really big reptiles. I don't know. You guys are going to have to see what I'm talking about and put in the comments what you think's going on. Thank you all for the love and the support. As you can tell, it's snowing out here. It's beautiful. Let's get exploring. I had to show you guys this really cool porch. The nice stonework. Up there looks like new brick though. Up here. See where that old brick stops and the new brick starts. So over the years they had an attachment. Their store was doing good. They were making money. I seen this spot was open, so here's hoping. Pretty neat how somebody put them like that. I'll make sure to put them back when I leave. You guys know that. Cool. Right. Relax for a minute. Here we are. Wow. A little bit of decay going on in here. But we start out with a table and chairs. hole in the roof in the ceiling so this goes down to the basement of this house maybe we can go down here and get up on the other side I see a lot of light down here okay never mind it just leads us out the side so it took us out that hole there I've got down in the cellar I can go, or in the window. Uh, the wish this was to choose your own path. You guys can choose. But with the size of me and the backpack, we're gonna take, whoa, the cellar. Stairs are icy. Whoa. Whoa. All right. So we got a chair. A real messed up concrete floor. Wow. Old workout bench and weights. More glass containers. Probably for their store. Well, I don't know, man. These guys must have had like monkeys. Uh, that are like really big birds. What do you guys think? Because their cages here all have these giant, giant pieces of wood through them. Put down in the comment what you think was, what you think was staying in here. I know that's bad, but I was just checking just in case. <laughs> yeah, put in the comments, what do you think kind of animals these people had considering the two or three cages that we've seen now, all that giant wood for them to crawl on, swing on. All right. Oh, the plaster coming down off the wall. Uh -oh. This door's locked, so people were climbing through the window. Forgive me, but I didn't want to climb through that window. There was glass on the bottom. See, didn't do much damage. Just opened it. <laughs> cool. 
Look at the wood in here. Oh, making noises. See how bad this wooden floor is moved? Walk very slow. Oh, you hear that? I ain't trusting that. All right, so we got a little loop. Look at the decay everywhere. We found the kitchen. <laughs> Look at that, the hole in the ceiling. That's messing everything up. But if you look, like there's still stuff left in the shelves. So this place was just left when, whenever it happened. It's crazy, look at the ice hanging down. But it's not even that cold, I overdressed, I'm sweating. What's through here? Got a little. More doors. A little kitchen area. Nice color. More color here. Let's go check out this area before we go upstairs and do all that. Wow. That's awesome. That's a crazy fireplace. This is an attachment somebody built onto the house. What's in here? Quick little look. A room with the roof gone. But that was inside the house at one point. This fireplace is huge. Look at more. More of these kind of cages. Maybe they had iguanas? Big lizards? I'm curious to read the comments when they come in, because you guys will know. There's even stairs to go upstairs. So I guess we're going. Look at all that crap. That's not good. I wasn't going to go all the way up, but I want to see what this machine is. It's a weird fax machine. top of the, the fireplace this wood feels real bad so that's about as far as I'm gonna venture out I'm not gonna step in that crap uh, this way back into the house We've got two rooms to check out before we go upstairs. Room number one. But it's got wood roofs, sorry ceilings. Beautiful old wood doors. Got a pink bathroom. Whoa, that's weird. So through here, there's a door. It looked like it would be a secret door through the closet of the bathroom. Got a bed, maybe somebody was staying. And that's back to this room. Okay. It's a nice layout. It's simple, it's easy. All right, let's go upstairs. As they say, up, up and away. Even the door inside the house had glass. You don't see that much. Plaster and everything coming down. Look at that. Just to show you guys how beautiful the decay is in this house. <laughs> like the wind came through the top little crack of the stairs and the way it touched my shoulder, it felt like somebody was pushing me. Hopefully I wasn't signed that somebody was pushing me. And look, we got a third floor. Okay. So let's just start here. 
I don't know how far I'm gonna be able to go into some of these because this one looks bad. But look, it's ice. Ice everywhere. See the ceiling coming down? Whoa. Okay. Yeah, this whole upstairs is ice. Kinda makes me nervous. Got a closet over there. Big windows. I like how you can almost sit in every single window that was in this house. Look at that. There's a closet there, but the floor was so messed up I wouldn't be able to open the door. Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Those are those noises you don't want to hear. Cool. Look at that. Old lamp, old TV. Just sitting in there. That's a cool pick. I'm starting to take more pics and I'm going to put more of them out onto my Instagram so that you guys can see. They're just cool, slow, still pictures. You guys know what I'm getting at. Green wall. Look at the paint and everything in there. That's really cool. To the third floor. Look at the ice on the stairs. You can hear the wind. We'll skip that stair. Okay. Somebody was staying up here. There's a bunch of like garbage and trash. They got a bed and there's some blankets. Books to read. Looks like a few people were staying up here. Wouldn't be the warmest place in the house though. <laughs> With all the cracks. And all the ice. All right. So I'm going to take some pictures and some snaps on my way down. And I'll see you guys outside of the house. Keep looking around. Do what you guys like inside the house. We'll meet up outside. The first little hut. See, it's empty. Just animals. Animals that were living. Roof's gone. Let's go away to the second little one. It's still intact. A little garbage area. That's it. A lot of trash. Too bad, that's too beautiful of a place to be storing your trash. As we walk down a little bit, they had a bit more going on here. You can see there was a house, well, another little barn type area, but it's collapsed. I could be taking the front, but the way that I'm walking, I'm in the back. Okay. Lots of trees down. Fell and wrecked the house, dog house, crazy. Here's the front view of the house that collapsed here. Must have been a little house, because look, it had an actual brick wall built for it. Or maybe a nice fancy barn, but there's shelves in there. You can see rugs, there's a chair. So somebody, somebody was actually living in there. And right there, right there is the house. I'll meet you there. To show you a little bit of the stuff that's scattered around the property. It's crazy. Tools, equipment, garbage, bins. Mostly all this stuff right here, see? Stuff that wasn't selling inside the shop. I just want to show you this little bit of an area. There's nothing in there. As you can see, the light through the bottom door, it's opened up on the other side. They were just squares. We're a little worse for wear. We'll see if we can get in there, but it's nothing too, too crazy. Oh, they even had a glass sign for their store. That's amazing. Okay. Okay. This is a prize. I can't believe it. Of course, it looks like the rummish fairies have been here, but still, there's everything. 
Everything left behind. Look at this. Huge barn. A glass shelf right away. There's the basement. We're going to go down there. I haven't gone down yet. I can only imagine what's down there. Look at this. We got an old TV. Bunch of old kids toys. We got a shelf here that somebody smashed up. Just glass and stuff. I thought there might have been a few things left. There's an old typewriter. Look, look at this beautiful door. These doors are expensive and take a peek over here. Look how many doors there are. Is that not just mind blowing? Sitting out here in a barn? How many years have they been out here? Look at this. We got dishes, we've got toys, we've got lanterns. I see some bikes. Even the stuff on the floors looks cool. This I looked at, look at this. This is just hundreds of doorknobs from old houses. An old vacuum. Look at that, look how old those vacuums are. This barn is starting to make a lot of noise. You guys might hear that. Like, look at this. It feels like I'm walking around a garage sale or a yard sale. You know what I mean? Look at that. These glasses, like combs, candles. Looks like they sold a little bit of everything here. We got stuff down underneath the tables. Old tins. We got a whole lot of luggage over here. Again, more doors. Oh, excuse me. Old microphones. Check that out. Did you notice there was a bunch of glass up around here, but people smashed them. More stained glass in those doors. Whoa, my backpack's knocking stuff off the shelf here, people. Little gadgets. Look, they sold gum. Bubblicious. No gum left. Look at this. A lot of old books. Trophies. This is crazy. Whoa. I'm trying not to step on stuff, but there's stuff everywhere. Like, look at this. Look at everything that's in here. I'm going to try and not make this video 10 hours long, but it most certainly could be. An old telephone with wheels. Look at that. A welder's mask. Just toys. Toys and toys. Bunch of kid stuff. Look at all the books here, everybody. And I love books. As I'm sure you guys have heard me say before, I want to have a little office area with a beautiful big desk and I want books and I've got about 10 globes already. This person sitting up on the shelf. Chairs. Now I've not seen any video of this place. If anybody else has, please let me know. Because I really think I'm the first that's going to be showing this house. This is nuts. And if you see stuff that you like, comment so that other people know. Look at all the old bikes. Old stove. Wow. We got a purple and white monkey. Here's a little view out the front. See? It's in the forest. It took a little bit of a drive to get to get here. 
old metal equipment. Look at that. Like that's old farm equipment. An old toy as well, shovel. It's getting windy and this place is making a lot of noise. What do we got in here? Hello? Oh, just garbage. A whole bunch of cans in that one. And just tarps in this one. Mm -hmm. Ugh. It kind of smells in there. The rest of the place doesn't. Look at that. Old electronic. Old electronic musical keyboard. A Cresta. Look at that. We got bikes hanging up there. We got bikes down here. We got skates all over the floor. I think those are tiles, probably. At first I thought they were the little A-tracks. The 35s, whatever you call them. Look at that. Holy. How old is that skate? A few old pairs. Wow. I know I've said wow a few times, but I'll probably say it a few more times. This is a piano. That's a piano lying on its back right there. Stripped. What? Look at this. Oh. Oh. I thought that was an old, uh, an old camcorder. She was just sitting there. Old clothes. Old chairs. Mickey. Old radios. Head lettuce, 50%. 50 cents, sorry. <laughs> What's going on here? Look, at, we even got tires. Got a whole lot of tires here. Got a bunch more bikes. Metal pieces. I hope I'm not going too fast. Please let me know. But again, with this place, this could be a really long video. And the long ones don't always get the best attention, so I gotta keep them a little bit shorter. All this stuff everywhere. Old chairs, we got tons of sinks, cabinets, drawers. We got animal cages. Oh, the toilets down there. Oh, and they got a pink one. Those are big bucks. I seen that on storage wars. Pink toilets, big bucks. That one looks pink, but it's not. <laughs> it's dirty. Over here, we've got a whole lot of glass. Mouse nest right here. Oh, looking a couple, a couple dead mice. They were babies. They're just tiny. A little view out the door. Hello, world. And look, just more windows. More windows and windows and windows. I'm gonna walk back so you guys can check out the area as I'm walking back. But I wanna show you this awesome wall. Of old, old computers. Start down there. Old floppies. Hey, that's nuts. That's crazy. We still got a basement. Oh, look at that. I didn't notice that it was a little pink, pink stove. Look at this area, people. Blinds up. <laughs> they were selling blinds too, because there's more up over there. All right, I'm gonna take a few slows in here. And we've still got a basement, and we've got the house. And a little bit of the property. So, stay tuned. Okay, wish me luck. 
We're going to try this basement out. Oh, I trusted that stair way too much. Oh, man. I'm not going to be able to fit through here. <laughs> All right, sit down. Oh, sit down on the stairs. Somebody threw a TV down the stairs. Housekeeping. Okay. Down here is just a barn. Not just a barn. Down here, look at this amazing barn, everybody. This is nuts. We got a lot of bird poo on a board. <laughs> no, I love this stuff. Okay. It's going on this way. That's how we'll get out to the house. Look at that old light right there, eh? Beautiful. Part of the roof's falling down. No smoking allowed. That's it. That's weird. I wonder if we can get to that from this side. But we'll take a little peek just to see what's going on here first. Back to the roots, eh? I love, I love old farmhouses. Look at this place. It's absolutely amazing. The oil tank lying down. The old desk, some more old doors. Old farmhouse is in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> cool. Lots of sheets. Maybe they had the dogs in here. Must have. I doubt that was from a squatter. Nasty cobwebs up there, boy. The versatile Appaloosa horse. All right. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna keep checking this barn. I wanna see what's down here on this end. I'm gonna walk kinda fast to get there. Hope the camera stays a little balanced. Look, looks like they had a, what's that, rabbits? Something small. And the bird nests on the ground. Ooh. Troughs. Nothing too crazy, but it looks like they took care of their animals very well. This place is clean. There's access everywhere. You can tell there's water everywhere. There's no crap anywhere. So these people, they must have been great people. I like that. Their secondhand store. I'm glad it's still good. Look, some some sort of a squirrel or chipmunk was hiding his his pine cones. All right. Well, I guess you guys don't got to walk back with me. We're gonna be out on the property as we walk back to the house. We'll do it that way. All right, explorers. What did you guys think of that spot, eh? What a cool, cool house. The barn was way better, but the house is almost kind of creepy, don't you think? I don't have a clue what was going on in there. If you guys do, please put in the comments and we'll all kind of put our two cents together and we'll figure out just what was going on there. But the barn, that was a secondhand store slash antique store. It was just beautiful, full of so much stuff. Those doors, how could there be so many left? Like that's just amazing to me. I absolutely love it. Thank you all for the love and the support. Let's try and like get this channel up to 100,000 this year, eh? Do you think that's possible? I do. Like it, subscribe it, share it. Thank you for the comments, for the love, for the views, for the support. Brandon O'Bannon, catch you on the next Explore. Ciao.
are the very ones that we need We hold a piece of the universe Indeed We hold a piece of the universe Fails in the back, but we still need to react. Not from old consciousness, cause Einstein was right, we ain't shit. We'll get the same kind. 